Chris's spawn is really out in front of healthcare, not only in the coastal bend, but really in the state of Texas in this transformation. We're gonna be able to provide some great services all on one campus, and then also fill a very important need in our community by, by providing that state-of-the-art outpatient center at Memorial. What's so great about trauma? Well, trauma is really, to me, is the purest form of medicine. I mean, it's indiscriminate. It doesn't, uh, it crosses all social, economic, ethnic barriers. You know, every day it's like, uh, a you know, whole new challenge. It's a great opportunity for all of us, more importantly for our community, to have every service under one roof to really be a true tertiary care center. With personal experiences, I know with change, uh, things get better. Uh, I know it makes me a better person, a better nurse, a better facilitator, and a better coach in my position. I truly believe it'll be a positive thing. There'll be some growing pains, naturally. We all understand that, we all feel that. However, uh, at the end of the tunnel, I believe there will be a positive clinic for all patients, especially the underserved and underprivileged. Spawn Shoreline actually treats more stroke patients than the public realizes, so by making a big investment, things like chest pain accreditation, primary stroke center accreditation, will be at a major advantage for uh, treating our community when they're suffering from a medical emergency. It's tough, you gotta go one place to have a doctor for me, you gotta go someplace else to have imaging done, you gotta go someplace else to have labs done. If they can have everything there in one place, then it'll be, it'll be a lot easier for them as a one-stop shop. Once everybody understands what's going to be going on with the Hector P. Garcia Center, everybody's going to really love it. Healthcare is not just about hospitals, so our transformation of care plan is to look at the continuum of care and how that care is delivered across that continuum and how we best can coordinate that care for our patients. You know, I love to be able to tell people thank you for the wonderful work that they do every single day. The commitment from our associates and our physicians and our volunteers, it penetrates the walls. It penetrates the buildings. It really speaks to the compassion and the commitment that our associates, physicians, and volunteers have to serve others.